Hello everybody, it's Mel and I'm doing another painting video. Um, I really wanted to do one today and I thought why the heck not do it with y'all. So today's gonna be, um, I you know, primary colors I guess I'm calling it. Also sorry for the shadow, kind of looks fun but I hope it doesn't annoy too many people. This is just the way it's gotta be. Um, so yeah, so I've got red, yellow, and blue already mixed up here. And I'm gonna add a little bit of silicone to each. I just have this like, gen whew, that smell, generic WD-40 type thing. Um, so I'm just gonna mix that in. That'll get some cells, but um, you know, not super worried about it. So mix those together. In my mixture, um, I just use a one-to-one -one ratio of um, like cheap acrylic paint. I just use the Apple Barrel and then Elmer's Glue Wall. I know a lot of people will also use water to thin it out, but mm, I have hard water, so I'm actually quite nervous about that causing a problem. I know people have said if you don't use like filtered water or something, it might mold in time. <laughs> I don't even want to deal with that, so I don't bother with the water. I just use the glue, and it works out pretty good for a cheap alternative. So yeah, so I'm just gonna fill this up with my layers. I'm gonna go little by little, um, and just kinda layer it on top so I can get multiple layers, and then I'm gonna do a flip and drag, which I haven't yet. But um, I've mostly done just straight flip cups. And um, I think I did one, one of the first ones I did, just like in my own experimentation, was a ring pour. And that one was fun because it kind of looks like tree rings or something. But I haven't done a flip and drag, so we're going to do it and see how that goes. But yeah, I'm I'm excited to see, all right, that looks like this is gonna be the last layer. Ooh, I hope I have enough paint. Um, I'm excited to see how the colors are gonna mix together. You know, cause we've got our primaries, so we should get some green, we should get some um, purple, and we should get some orange. Maybe <laughs> it'll it'll be interesting. I guess it also depends how the consistency because I tried to make them all the same consistency, but you know it's hard to get it perfectly. All right, that's that's gonna be good enough. I'll just move all these over here, and what I'm gonna do is put it, yeah. So I'm gonna have it on this end. I'm gonna give it a minute to let kind of all that fall down. And then what I'm gonna do is drag it across. And that should give us a pretty cool effect. And, you know, we're, we're just gonna see. We're gonna see how that goes. I'm hoping it'll, I'm hoping it'll work good and cells will pop up and like it'll look neat, so. Let's see how it goes. Oh, I'm nervous. All right, three, two, one. Oh, ooh. All right. Oh, yeah. Got a little muddy toward the end. Ooh, fun. I also brought out a spoon in case I need to really pull out some colors. Um, ooh, I forgot to put down my wax paper on my table, so it's just my straight up tablecloth over here. Oh my gosh, that's looking fun. Okay, I'm gonna, I don't have a torch or anything, but I saw somebody, and I hope this is safe, but I saw somebody use just a straight up lighter. So I'm gonna try that to pop some of the bubbles. Uh, hopefully that's okay. All right, let's see, is it popping the bubbles? I don't wanna catch anything on fire. I saw somebody do this, I swear. Eh, I don't think it's really working. That, that bubble's not popping. All right, well, we tried. Hopefully, 
hopefully that stuff will figure itself out as we go. Ew, I don't like the way that smells. Maybe that was a bad idea. All right, so let's um, let's just tilt it around and see. Uh, I don't know which way to go first. I guess I'll go this way. And well, I guess the consistency is pretty decent since it's flowing pretty well. Although that blue, oh my gosh, it looks like a tornado right here. Hmm. The way the blue is taking over, it may not have, in fact, been the right consistency. Because <laughs> sometimes I get, I think that happens. Oh, that's a cool little cell. I don't want to lose that. Oh, yeah. I think, uh, yeah, this is turning into be like all blue. That's unfortunate. Oh, no. Did you see that? I got some on my tablecloth. That's okay. I'll survive. All right, let's see. Oh my gosh, actually I got a lot on my tablecloth. I um, should have put down extra protection. All right, I'm trying to make sure the edges are all good. Yeah, wow, this did not turn out how I thought it was going to. We do have some orange and some green, but I'm gonna try and put some of the, let's turn it on, try and bring some of the paint back because I don't want it to be all blue, you know? Ooh, but I also don't have a lot of paint left. You know, it kind of gives a neat look on its own, even though it's mostly blue. And there's, it turns into green a little bit, and we are bringing some of the paint back. But I do like this corner up there, so I don't want to lose that. Yeah, wow, I'm making a huge mess. I done goofed, you guys. All right, bring it back a little more. Yeah, not, not what I thought was gonna happen, but I I don't hate it. All right, you know what? I think that's good. I don't wanna, I don't wanna take too much away. Wow. Sorry about the light. I think that's kind of cool. Um, again, it's not what I thought was gonna happen, but like this kind of looks like a little jellyfish. Um, I don't know, it, it looks kind of neat. I, I actually like it. It's a little simpler than I thought it was gonna be. Maybe I didn't put enough silicone. I know last time a lot of bubbles, I mean, a lot of cells came up. And here we just have a few. So it's possible that the blue is too thick, but I really like what happened up here. It just, I, I like this one. What would you guys call it? Give me uh, your names for this piece. And uh, yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. And I, I enjoy doing these. Uh, you know what, that's fine. <laughs> Did you see that? I just flung some paint. Okay, I am going to grab my paper towel and wipe off my hands so I don't do that again. <laughs> but it kind of looks cool because it kind of looks like that one. Anyway, I, um, yeah, I like this one. I like doing these painting videos. I like crafty stuff. So hopefully you'll come back and hang out with me and see some more. All right, guys, here's how it looks after, I don't know, maybe a half hour or so. Some more little cells and things are popping up. Um, yeah, it's looking pretty neat. So that's the that's the final look. I can't wait to see when it's totally dry, but there's the final look for y'all. All right, bye-bye.